rumorous highways and metropolitan secrets, shining shopping malls and desert nightly landscapes. A generation of young men and women, global cosmopolitans with a touch of Indian sin. According to the Hindu calendar, today we live in Kalyu, the age of confluence, speed, materialism and confusion. Having absorbed the passage of time, of conquerors and lovers, India is today working its way into Kalyu, producing a new yet old mystique. I remember my days at um, the university undergrad days. You'd sit on the football and watch the world go by. It was, you know, just, just a sort of thing. Career, uh, sex. Strangely, yes. I mean, that, that's what dominated because I remember when I went to the university, that was the time when India was, you know, changing. And very quickly, so it had a lot to do with the economy having opened up. Um, the first thing that brought um, that it brought in to, to India was satellite TV. And that was one of the biggest catalysts for change. This is downtown Delhi. This was built by the British. Uh, as their outpost to old Delhi, uh, conceived as a place where the Brits and the natives would meet and mingle, a commercial place, shops, restaurants, um, well, 50, 60 years down the line, the Brits have gone away, they're no longer the rulers here, but this is still where the world meets. Uh, you have people from all over the country, the natives, come in, tourists, foreigners who come in, this is where they usually start their trip of Delhi. This is also the place where a lot of Delhi comes to work. Mm, it's chaos, but there is a method to its madness as well, which you shall find out as you go along. Yes! Woohoo! Best new time! 